Hi, my name is Chad Wingrave. I'm Chief Tinkerer here at Walnut Street Labs. And I'm here to demonstrate a project we have, which is a little bit beyond the typical tchotchkes people make with 3D printers. This is a hanging slat from uh, the blinds that would go in someone's house to block out lights that comes in. And what typically happens is this chunk comes out. So that brakes pull straight up and you lose your slat. So what I decided to do was figure out a way to replace it with 3D printing. My first iteration, I went through and put together a piece that could be glued on to this slat like this and then it would just fit and hang. And this is a pretty decent first go. But what I realized was you're gonna have troubles actually sticking this thing to the slat with the glue. So what we're trying to do is create a better insert. And I added the scruff marks to this that you can't see very well. But it adds a place for the glue to fit when we glue this slat back on. So that not only will it be a strong fit, but it'll also uh, stick better to the slat. The main problem with these slats is that the plastic breaks. So even though we're using plastic, which is a little bit thicker than what the typical slat uses, I figure what we could do is design this piece as an alternative to put a piece of metal in, and then we use that metal, which is a lot stronger than the plastic, to anchor this tab. That's what we're, going, we're printing right there, is the new piece for the metal slat to come in. So what we're getting here is you can see the 3D printer printing in the layers of plastic. And as the plastic cools, it shows it going back to a blue temperature. And the new layers coming in are red. And if you can see it over on the 3D printer, it's, going, it's printing away. Here's our first iteration, our first try. Our second iteration adds ridges to support the glue a little bit better. And our third iteration is what we went for because it has a spot for a metal bar to go in, which is a lot stronger than the plastic, and has roughed up edges. And we are very happy with that. Hello, I'm Chad Wingrave, Chief Tinker here at Walnut Street Labs. If you'd like to, do, to create a 3D printer for projects you have in your mind, go ahead and sign up at walnutstreetlabs.com.